Hey, didn't see you there. My name's Riley. Say, do you guys have any friends? No. Well, I do. Two to eight of them to be exact, which is why I invited all my friends over to play some Monopoly. I love everything about Monopoly. All the random themed boards are so fun. The random bullshit in the game keeps the game fresh and exciting. And my favorite thing about the game is that it's not Super Mario Party for the Nintendo Switch. SON OF A B- The Mario Party series has been a staple of a Nintendo console since the N64. Releasing in 1998 for the Nintendo 64, Mario Party was praised as being a fun but sometimes shallow experience. Since then, Nintendo has improved the formula and Mario Party has become a household name that won't destroy your palms like the first one did. However, the games haven't always been received positively. In 2015, Nintendo released Mario Party 10, which received mostly mixed reviews at launch. IGN even described it as being the 9-11 of Mario Parties. Now, I know that sounds fake, but you're not going to fact check me, so, uh, so take it as real. With the release of the Nintendo Switch came another opportunity for Nintendo to release another Mario Party, and improve on the last game, which received negative reviews. Maybe even go back to what made Mario Party fun. Instead, they released the actual 9-11 of Mario Parties. The Mario Party series is known for its interesting board designs, fun minigames, and simply a competitive game design. Nintendo took all of that and said, hey, let's do the opposite. Now, as you can probably tell, I don't like this game, but I already invited all my friends over, so we might as well just save Monopoly for my bachelor party. Hey there! Call us? You guys like to party? No. Again. <laughs> Three, two. The first step to any successful game of Mario Party is to have your friend call you before you start and interrupt your recording session. So sorry for bothering you. Really embarrassing. Um, so my dick fell off and I'm trying to find it. Uh, I don't- the flashlight on my camera isn't working. Okay. Oh yeah? <laughs> dude, I really need your help right now, dude. <laughs> I've always been a big fan of Wario. <sighs> Alright, now we gotta pick which NPC we want to play with us. There's three different difficulty levels. Uh, which one do you guys think we should pick? Very hard. Very hard. Super Mario Party has four of the worst designed boards in the series. The worst of which is Kamek's Tantalizing Tower. The star stays in one place. The map lacks the higher valued items that the other maps have, like the Golden Pipe. The Lakitu is extremely hard to get to, making stealing stars annoying at best. All of these come together to make the map extremely boring to play on. Ooh, let's pick that one! Well, at least only for 10 turns. I'm in hell. All right, let's roll to see who goes first. That's not a good thing. It's good for that me. I got a one inch dick. What do you expect? I like that. <laughs> you put that in the video. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. I didn't want to remember this moment, buddy. I <laughs> fucking hate you. All right, first minigame. Let's see what it is. You know, this is what I love about Mario Party. The minigames are always so fun. You're a fucking idiot! This one sucks! Finish! Yeah. Uh -huh. Winner! Best mini game ever! Oh shit, Cream, you got a hidden block, which means you can get a star! Ah. Fucking loser. Uh, yes, no, this one! This fucking... Oh yeah, it's time for a toad tip! You can have my toad tip. You got stars. I 
got two stars! Ah, uh, good for you! Fuck, this minigame sucks! Fuck you! Soaker Croak? That sucked. Hey look, Bowser can 40 fucking stars. What a fucking idiot. You know, I'm starting to question whether or not he's actually hard or not. He's very hard! <laughs> Stand by, my dick is currently in a toaster. <laughs> Oh, right, it's not a the video. Five coins, nice. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Mario gets Peach, Luigi gets Daisy, and Mario gets fucking paid. Crank, can you put that in the video? <laughs> Let's fucking go. I don't fucking play. Count that one, two, three, four, and five stars. I'm a contender in this bitch. Uh, you sound like someone who's about to be coin NATO'd, Kareem. You should really start pleading your case. I actually take it back. Uh, so at the, let, let's start. Let's start from the beginning. Uh, Bowser right now is very hard. He has a lot of coins. I feel like he's a contender, and you're, you should Wait, be taking him seriously. He's, he's a, very hard. Yeah, he's yeah, very, very hard. hard. Shit. You know what? I'm still gonna do it. Okay. His box got a nine. Have you ever considered that the nine is just an upside down six? You need to get your eyes checked, you fucking idiot. How is it only turn eleven? Skill issue. Fuck! And I have money for the fucking stars. What a fucking this idiot, dude! Fucking stupid. Oh my, he's probably kill himself. Why the fuck are the toads sitting side by side with spikes, man? What the fuck is this bullshit? Are you saying they should, like, segregate by race and class? Yes, yes I am. I want the reds and not mixed with the greens. Oh, I'm good at this one. All you gotta do is spam A and you'll win every time. Damn, that was a close one. Oh shit, Snack Attack is my favorite! What the fuck is this? Alright, just three turns left and the game thinks Bowser is gonna win. Yeah, I'd kill for him. And you can get three stars in one go now. We are so fucking back, baby! What the actual fuck?! And I got another ally. <laughs> the joke writes itself here. And that was the final mm. minigame. Let's see who won. And of course it was Kareem. I've won? I've won? Dude, I couldn't have done it without Wario. This is the best day of my life. I'm going to be celebrating this forever. You earned it. You Congrats. Know what? You know what? Thank you, Ollie. And I just want to thank a lot of people that who have supported me on my journey here. It's okay. And Don't we're going to start with, uh, number one, I want to oh, thank Wario. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Super Mario Party, and that was actually worse than I remember it being. You can tell a lot of heart went into this game. It has a very vibrant aesthetic, and some of the minigames are okay, but I think Nintendo really dropped the ball with this one. All of the maps fucking suck, especially the Kamek one we played. A vast majority of the minigames aren't bad? They're more difficult than they should be, and just boring. Overall, I think the game has a lot of style, but lacks a lot of substance, and it's just a shallow experience overall. I think Nintendo should have gone back to what they did in the earlier Mario Parties when it comes to minigame design. The release of Super Mario Party on the Nintendo Switch marked another entry into the series, but it just shows how much Nintendo has improved from Super Mario Party. That game has actually good boards and minigames, and while it does recycle a lot of the minigames from past Mario Parties, that's kind of the point, and I think that overall they get away with it in that game and it just is a lot better use of the mini games in the boards formula than in this game. No matter which way you slice it, I think Super Mario Party is unfortunately bad. I really wanted to like this game when I bought it originally because everyone can enjoy the Mario series even if you don't have a strong connection to it. Past Mario Parties were really fun 
and it's unfortunate that this one is just a slog to play, even with friends. We played the 20 turns mode, which took about two hours to finish, but I think that even if we weren't, it would still be really boring, even with friends. I mean, don't get me wrong, I had a lot of fun playing with my friends, even though Kareem kicked my ass by a mile, but I'm glad I won't have to revisit this in the future. Well, now that I've played Super Mario Party for hopefully the last time, I have to find a new party game to play with my friends, and I have to start practicing early so Cream doesn't kick my ass next time. I heard about this brand new party game everybody's playing nowadays, so I've got to start practicing early. Let's play Russian Roulette. Shame. 